Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another video. So if you are new to my channel, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. I'm Charlotte and I'm so, so happy that you did. In today's video, you guys would have already seen by the title, I'm going to be sharing with you 10 outfit ideas when you have nothing to wear. <laughs> Okay, so these are gonna be daytime, mostly daytime looks. They're gonna be casual outfit ideas for those days when you look at your wardrobe and you think, I have no inspiration <laughs> and there is nothing to wear. So I have these days quite often. I look at all my clothes and think, there's nothing in there to put an outfit together. But hopefully in today's video, I'm gonna give you a little bit of inspiration and you're gonna find some things that you can pull together to make a really cute outfit. So if you are excited for the video, then please do give it a big old thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, feel free to hit subscribe and let's get on with the video. So the first outfit I want to share with you all is this outfit that I'm wearing today. And I actually wore this outfit yesterday. So the day I'm filming this is Monday. I wore it on Sunday out and about and it was the perfect outfit. It's warm, it's cozy, it's comfortable, but it still looks chic. So this outfit, I didn't know what to wear. So I had a look in my wardrobe, found this hoodie. This hoodie is just a cream color hoodie from New Look. This blazer is a blazer from Mango, so I am loving the hoodie blazer combination. I think it just dresses up a really casual outfit and I think it just looks really chic, so I'm loving it. And I've also paired it with a pair of leather leggings. These are my Mango leather leggings, I absolutely love them. I am gonna be inserting cutaways so you can see the outfits a little bit better as well. Um, and then I have just teamed this look with a pair of chunky heels. So these are chunky boots, they're from H&M. I got them last year, but I will link some similar down below. And um, I will try and link all these looks for you as well. I know there's gonna be a lot, <laughs> but I will try and link them for you. And then I finished off the look just with this brown bag. So this is a brown croc print effect bag. This one is from ASOS and I just thought it was cute just to add a splash of, I suppose like 90s chic to the look with this shoulder bag. And yeah, this is the first look. <laughs> Okay, so for look number two, I have gone for this basic white vest top, which is from Mango. I've then teamed it with my trusty Zara oversized dad blazer, which I absolutely love. I sized up to a size large, I think, in this blazer, and it works so nicely as a bit of an overcoat. I've teamed it with this bag. This bag is from ASOS, but it's mango. Um, I then teamed it with a pair of grey joggers. I felt like everybody has a pair of grey joggers in their wardrobe, so these are super easy and just super comfy to wear. And then I finished off the look with a pair of chunky oh, white trainers. As I say, you'll be able to see a bit better in the cutaways. But I really like teaming the kind of mix of smart and casual with the blazer and the joggers. I think it works really, really nicely. And then, as I said, I've just added this light colour bag, which I think just finishes off the look a little bit. But yeah, absolutely love this. Such a wearable, easy, comfortable look when you have nothing to wear. So another outfit that I absolutely love wearing is a midi skirt with a roll neck jumper or just a generally a kind of a knitted fluffier oversized jumper. I think the contrast works really really nicely. So this roll neck is from ASOS and this skirt is also from ASOS and I've just teamed the kind of the colours here so I've gone for a neutral on top with a black and spot detail on the bottom. I love adding prints and textures into my autumn into wardrobe and I just think when you have nothing to wear if you chuck on a skirt that's got a bit of texture a bit of movement to it with a basic kind of comfy jumper I think it works really really nicely and it looks as if you've made more effort than you actually have so that's great in my book this little black croc effect bag I can't remember where it's from it's so old but I will try and find something similar and then I've just finished the look with a pair of light these are almost off-white boots. These ones are from Nasty Girl. So this next look is a gorgeous look that's finished off with this beautiful trench coat. So this gorgeous trench coat is from ASOS. I love it because it is almost like a brownie check. 
and I love prints and checks and colours and to have a brownie check is really really lovely actually this time of year rather than just sticking to your blacks and your greys and your whites and um, I love the fact that when you roll the sleeves up it does have this brown colour detail here and underneath the trench I've just got a very plain white vest top which is from Mango. I've then added a pair of Zara tailored trousers. These trousers are a really light brown colour. I then teamed it with some brown accessories. So I've got this brown belt which is also from Zara. I've got brown boots which are from Mango. And then I have chucked on my brown ASOS handbag as well. Just to add a few more kind of tonal brownie colours to the look. And yeah, I just love it. <laughs> and for this next look, I've added one of my favourite pieces of the season so far. And that is this oversized collar shirt from Zara. So this one is absolutely beautiful. It also does have oversee oversized sleeves. <laughs> Try and spit that one out. And I just like to roll my sleeves up slightly just to give it a bit more of a I suppose ruffled unfinished look which I think makes it a bit more casual I then teamed it with a really really basic pair of mum jeans these jeans are from Shadowvarius on ASOS super super affordable and I love them I think just teaming a more I suppose more dressy shirt with a basic pair of jeans works really nicely if you're wanting to stay a bit more on the casual side and then to finish the look I've added a pair of these cream nasty girl boots again you will see in these videos I will be interchanging pieces that I have in my wardrobe because I do think it's really important to have a core group of staple things and mix in trend pieces where you can but I like to mix and match as many things as I can because we don't need 100 handbags and we don't need all of these things it's good to be able to create lots of outfits with the same pieces so i've also chucked back in this bag which is mango asos and yeah i just really like the way that this looks like you've made an effort but you have also dressed it down with a pair of jeans which makes it look really timeless and classic this next outfit it's probably one of my favourites because it's so easy, it looks really effortless but as if you've made an effort and it's just really wearable and it's probably consisting of things you may already have in your wardrobe. So what it is, is I've teamed this cardigan, so I'm loving cardigans this season, I think they're just such a versatile, really effortlessly chic piece to add to your wardrobe. So this cardigan is from ASOS. It's this beautiful mixed brown, almost a tobacco-y colour. I've then teamed it with my leather leggings, which are from Mango again. And then I finished off the look with the biker boots from Nasty Girl. <laughs> you can kind of see them. Um, and I just think this whole look is so easy, but it looks really chic. And I finished it off with my Prada handbag as well. So yeah, I just really like it. It's such an easy, wearable thing. And you can interchange this jumper or cardigan for any other jumper or cardigan you have, chuck a blazer on top if you're feeling a bit cold and that's your look ready to go. So this next look is very similar to the last look. I'm still wearing the same cardigan and the same leather leggings as before, but I've added on this gorgeous aviator jacket with faux fur. I think aviator jackets are such an amazing piece to add to your wardrobe. They are just effortlessly chic, aren't they? They're so easy just to chuck on. They make your outfit look really, really put together and finished. I then chucked over, this is just a Marc Jacobs handbag, just to add a little bit more gold and a little bit more detail. And then I've switched my boots to a pair of just black patterned heels. And yeah, this is the next look. <laughs> So I'm adding in a pop of colour for this next look and I'm adding in this gorgeous, gorgeous coat. This is from H&M and it is this powder blush pink colour which is just beautiful. It is such amazing quality and fabric, it's really, really lovely and it's just got a beautiful just belt detail around the waist as well. So you can sit yourself in if you want to. And then underneath the pink coat, I've kept things quite plain and simple and I have just worn all white. So I've got a white vest top, which is the same one from Mango. I've also got a pair of white jeans. These are cut off jeans, which are from H&M. And then to add a little bit of fun to the outfit, I've added some snakeskin boots, which are also from H&M. Then this bag is just a little baguette bag from Mango with this gorgeous gold chain detail, which I absolutely love. It really adds something a little bit different to the outfit. And yeah, I love it. <laughs> I, think, I think I've said that every time, but I genuinely do like these outfits. This next look, is very monochrome inspired. I just don't think you can go wrong with monochrome. It's timeless, it's classic, 
It's so incredibly easy to wear and it pretty much suits everybody. Um, I have just teamed this roll neck black knit from New Look with this H&M dog tooth or hands tooth print jacket. And um, this one I actually got last year, but they may have something similar this year. I'll see if I can find anything. And then I've also teamed the look with these white jeans. So again, sticking very monochrome. And then finished it off with these cream boots. Also, again, with my Marc Jacobs black handbag, just to finish it off. And I am just loving a real timeless monochrome look at the moment. And hopefully you guys do too. And the final look to share with you today is this really comfy look. So I've gone for a matching loungewear set. So this is a hoodie and some joggers from Glamify. And then I've also teamed it with this really light, almost a light sage green colour trench coat, which is from Pretty Little Thing. And then I've just added a shoulder bag. This black and white shoulder bag is from DVF. And then I've teamed it with a pair of white chunky trainers. And this is just a really easy, casual running out to the shops and running errands outfit and I feel like everyone has a lounge dresser and a trench coat in their wardrobes so it's super easy just to chuck on and it looks effortless. So that is everything for today's video guys. I really hope you've enjoyed it and it's given you some ideas and inspiration to mix up your wardrobe a little bit and hopefully you've found some ideas of what to wear when you have nothing to wear. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please do give it a big thumbs up because it really helps to support my channel and I'd love to have you around for the long term. So feel free to head on over and hit that subscribe button for new videos every single week from me. And thanks so much for watching. Okay, <laughs> see you in the next one guys. Bye.